Hello and welcome to another wine tasting. To celebrate Halloween, I've decided to try this one. It's called Bat's Blood, The Taste of Transylvania. It leads a luscious dark dream, David Pierce Hughes. And it's Merlot. I'll just read the back to you. Bat's Blood Merlot, Transylvania. Dry red wine. Trockener Rotwein. Vin Rouge, Sec, Red Table Wine, Wine of Romania. For over a thousand years, some of Europe's most delicious wines have been produced in the ancient and historical region of Transylvania. With each sip from our Bat's Blood Merlot, you will discover a subtle hint of those wild fruits which grow among the forests that lie close to the Carpathian Mountains. It is the most perfect accompaniment to good food and deserves to be shared with great company. No bats or any other mammals are ever harmed in the making of our wine. You can discover more about our wine, Transylvania, bats, steampunk, and all things gothic, as well as being able to join in our community events at www.batsblood.com. We look forward to meeting and greeting you there. And so, this was bottled in Cremille Rekes SA in Romania for a company in London and sent to Australia. Yes. So, uh, very curious about this one. Uh, being a cork, uh, probably going to finish it tonight. So, um, give me a few seconds to open it, and then we'll see what it's like. It's very cute. Okay. Let's see what it's like, yeah? Mmm, very fruity. Different touch of oak there. It smells quite nice. Light. Mmm. Yeah, this is a really nice little wine, uh, ideal for Halloween, um, because of the, the label it looks pretty cool, so it'll look good on a, on a table if you're organising a mini Halloween party for friends. Um, definitely um, nice oaky notes there, quite fruity. You can pick up some plum, um, very faint taste of dark chocolate. And um, probably some sour cherry, but there's no finish on it. It's quite easy to drink, and um, I'd say it's about 12% alcohol. So it's quite light for a red, but it is a Merlot. So um, if you like the European Merlot styles, uh, this is the sort of thing that um, you'll probably enjoy. And um, yeah, for me, uh, I'm... I prefer the, the stronger flavoured ones, but this one I can definitely drink uh, at a party or something like that. It will go well with a lot of uh, uh, like finger food. So yeah, if you're organising a Halloween party anytime soon, uh, check this one out. It'll look good on the table. Until next time.